Welcome to our channel. Today we're exploring a crucial concept in the Six Sigma methodology, common cause variation. Understanding this concept is essential for anyone involved in process improvement. Unlike special cause variation, which is unusual and often caused by specific circumstances, common cause variation is inherent in the system. Imagine you're a chef preparing a favorite dish. Even when following the recipe perfectly, minor variations can occur. These could be slight differences in ingredient quality or subtle changes in cooking temperature. These are examples of common cause variation. They're not due to any specific error or mistake, but stem from the natural variability in the process. In Six Sigma, we aim to minimize variation as much as possible. However, eliminating common cause variation is neither practical nor necessary. Instead, the focus is on reducing special cause variation and controlling common causes to a manageable level. This involves standardizing processes, training employees, and maintaining equipment to ensure consistency. But why is it important? By distinguishing between common and special causes, we can better allocate resources to address significant issues rather than spending time on inevitable fluctuations. This allows businesses to enhance quality and efficiency sustainably. So, how do you identify common cause variation in your process? Statistical tools like control charts can be highly effective. These charts help by visually representing process stability and identifying trends over time. If the data points within a control chart consistently fall within the control limits, the process is stable and any variation present is likely a common cause. However, if points are outside these limits or specific patterns, you might deal with special cause variation. Remember, a key principle in Six Sigma is to understand the voice of the process and respond appropriately. Recognizing common cause variation allows you to improve processes without chasing after minor deviations. On behalf of the Infinilian team, thanks for joining us on this journey into the fundamentals of Six Sigma. Don't forget to subscribe for more insights into process improvement and quality management. See you on the flip side.